Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Now I did put a little post out asking people what they would like to see more of on the channel and you voted for horror so here we are. This game is called Fear the Moon and this is what it says. A story driven cryptid horror game featuring survival horror elements where you come face to face with an Ohio cryptid dubbed the Wolfman. Play as Jane and fight to survive the full moon while uncovering dark secrets in the Wolfman's territory. Now this I believe is chapter one of three chapters. Um, so I'm quite interested to see how this goes. It's been getting really good reviews. So... Um, I think that'll do. Let's just jump straight in. That dream again. Well, I guess I should get up anyway. I mean, I'm loving the music on it already. The ambience is quite creepy. <clears throat> um. Oh, oh, we can spin. Oh, right, okay. I thought we were going to maybe be able to... Um... We can't actually do anything with the computer. We can turn it on, though. Right, so we've got our phone now. Right, how do I get up? Right, can I get out of the seat now? Oh, looks like Melissa called me. I should give her a call back. Okay, let's call her back. Jane, it's been a while. Yeah, it has. I hope you've been alright. Yeah, I've been great actually. Just busy. How about you? Doing alright. Not dead. That's good to hear. I was beginning to wonder. Can't get rid of me that easily. Hey. I'm going to be back in town soon. We should hang out. Really? Yeah, that would be great. Yeah, Jack actually had an idea where we could go on a little camping trip this weekend. Like old times. Would you be interested? <laughs> yeah, that could be fun. Great. I'm so excited. I think James is coming too. Really? What's the occasion? It's a secret. Oh, come on. Nope, you'll have to wait. Fine, fine. Oh, the over the head view. This is pretty cool, actually. Oh, wow. Somewhere in Ohio. <laughs> so we don't know where we are. Jeez. Um, we're being watched already. Jesus. Well, we're here. This is the campsite. Yeah, nice, isn't it? I don't know. What do you think? Me, personally, I'm creepy. I like this kind of place, so... Uh, yeah, I like it. Yeah, it's cool, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it'll grow on me. At least we can have a fire. 
We used to hang out near here forever ago. I guess you guys didn't come along. Well, we should start getting things set up before it gets dark. You're right, James, because trying to build tents and stuff like that when you have no light is a nightmare. This music is really vibing me out, creep-wise. This is chapter one. Like I said, I think it's going to be three chapters, and this demo's free to play. I'll put a link for it in the description. Obviously, cryptids and that, they, they really creep me out, especially... In this game, they call it a wolf man, but in actual fact, what I would really call it is a dog man. And when you actually research dog men, they're not werewolves, they're not humans that turn into men. Eh, uh, sorry, wolves. They're just creatures like Bigfoot that are permanently stuck in this wolf form. And if you've ever seen Van, Van Helsing, I'll flash an image of one of them on the screen just now. Um, this is what people claim they look like and that they are horrific. You should listen to some of the stories people have told if you believe that sort of thing. Which I do, by the way. Very big paranormal. So what do you think of the place? It's cool, I guess. A bit eerie though, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but that's part of the fun. I guess. Hey, don't worry. If anything comes out to us tonight, I've got this baby with me. I suppose you just pulled that out in your ass. Thanks, Jack. That makes me feel a bit better. You know you can always count on me, winks. Oh, Jack. No, no, I thought you were with Melissa. What's going on here? Maybe we're all just friends. <laughs> Maybe I'm just reading the wrong end of the baseball bat here. Hey, sorry if this didn't meet your expectations. I guess I probably should have chose the location. Oh, no, it's fine. I'm, I'm just glad to see everyone again. Yeah, me too. It'll be fun to hang out once we get everything set up. I mean, it does seem like it's taken just quite a while to um, get those tent pegs put in. And Jack just seems to be um, pointing quite a lot, so our tent? Can't do anything with our tent. Look at that fog down there, it's creepy. What is this? Is this like a big bag of like dog food or something? I don't know why there's an arrow on this. Hot dogs? Oh, beer! I'll have a beer! No one giving me a beer? Hey, I'm glad you ended up coming. Well, Melissa really wouldn't take no for an answer. But yeah, me too. It's nice to see you. Yeah, you too. Do you need help with anything? It looks like we forgot to buy firewood on the way here. Melissa won't be happy about that. Yeah. There might still be some firewood left over inside a shack that's near here. Do you think you could go grab it? Sure. How do I get there? Oh, it's not too far. Just follow the right path and you'll find it. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Cool. It's going to get dark soon though, you should take this. Okay. Lantern. Nice. Thanks. Try not to get lost. <clears throat> right, so tabs inventory. Oh, we actually took the hot dogs? Um, get firewood from the shacks. Right, so I've got this out. And if I press 1, does it go away? No, it doesn't. I can't... It's just stuck out then, I take it. What is James doing? We can run. Yeah, I just figured that out. <gasps> oh! Jesus Christ, I don't think it's just... Dude, sneaky devil. 
did he put in that tree? What's he doing? What's he doing? Guys, I don't trust James. <gasps> Put something over here. What is this? The board seems sturdy. Guess I really don't want anyone going inside. Not that I would want to anyway. You're up to James. I don't trust you! Where's he going? Cage. What's it doing all the way out here? James, if, if you're trying to catch this dog man and using this trip is like a front for it. Oh, James! Creepy, isn't it? Oh, James, you scared me. Well, you didn't have scare me, James. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what were you saying? The house. You can see it from here. Oh, yeah, I guess it's pretty creepy. Anyway, it's getting dark soon. Be sure not to get lost out here. Well, I'm following your creepy ass. I don't know what the hell you're up to. Can I crouch? Apparently not. Wait, I'm running this way. It says there should be a cabin down the right hand path. This, this will, I think, should take us back to the right hand path. <gasps> oh, what is this? Open. Ugh. It said they stalk the woods at night, forever starving, forever in pain, aching to fill their empty stomachs. stomachs. To feast on the meat and organs, and once you hear their scratches echoing through the trees, it's already too late. Wow. Damn birds. Oh! Oh! Are you going to try and attack me? Here, have the hot dogs. Okay, they just not want me going near that trash can. I suppose trash pandas are going to be, um, what do you call it, um, protective of their trash, I suppose. This ambient music is so creepy, by the way, and I hope it translates. Please watch with headphones if you're not already. Huh? Hello? He's watching you. God, I hope not. No. Fear the moon. I accidentally locked the shed on my way out. Whoops. I think the key should be somewhere in that abandoned vehicle on the cliff. Also, I think something might have died in here. The place reeks. Oh, 
Game, are you just teasing me? What is with an empty toolbox? Locked. Well, that's that taken care of then, I suppose. Why did the music just ramp up? Get up the ladders. I can't get behind the house. I need to go back to that car then, I suppose. I mean, oh! I know the graphics aren't great on this, but my god, it's definitely done such a great job at creating an eerie environment. Like, branches keep twitching in like, my left ear, my right ear. How do I crouch? See my bit. Oh, there we go. Um, a, a shack key, and I, I can't take the screwdriver. Are you kidding me? On? Why would you leave a perfectly good screwdriver behind? I mean, I was just in the shack. I've never seen any wood anywhere. Where does it think I'm going to find wood? Why don't we just rip down the old shack? And use that for wood. Oh wait, hang on, is this like a little storage bit? Shack key. Shack key, little Neil. What the hell is this? Pick up. Gotten pretty dark, I should head back. Yeah. I can see something! Oh my god, guys. I might just run. Oh! Hello? I know I'm probably like a blonde teenage girl and we always die pretty quickly in horror movies, but please, sir. Oh! Oh my god. The eyes. <gasps> Fuck this. No, no, just keep going, keep going, your friends are there. Oh my god, my body is shivering right now. Take your damn wood! Hey, are you okay? You, you saw a ghost. It wasn't a ghost! I heard something weird in the woods. Oh? What did it sound like? I don't know, like a, a, a wolf or something? Huh? That's strange. Wolves haven't been anywhere near this area in like 200 years or something. You sure it wasn't a bobcat? Their scream sounds like a person dying. Maybe it was a wolf man. Come on now, Jack. Don't be ridiculous. What? He could be real. You know the stories too. 
Yeah, I do, and it's made up. What's the wolf man? Just a bit of an urban legend. A, 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 a urban legend around here. I swear I saw him in the woods one time after a party. And how many drinks did you have that night? I don't know. Few. Mm-hmm. I really did see something though. It was big and tall with bright eyes. Is that why you chose this place, Jack? Maybe. I can't believe you! I'm sure it was probably nothing. Just freaked me out a bit, that's all. Yeah, even if a wolf did find its way around here, we're probably fine. Just stay near the camp. Can we get this fire started now? It's getting cold out here. I mean, I can see two things that might be getting very cold right now. Yeah, I'm ready to relax. Fine, fine, I'll get it started. Cinematic, I love it. Okay, maybe not so much now. Uh, we went from being nice and airy to um, something's coming. <gasps> Jane, what are you looking at? Oh, sorry, it's just that it's a full moon out tonight. Now that's another thing about um, dog men. They aren't werewolves, it's not the moon that turns them. They're born as these creatures. So this game might be more werewolf than dog man, but in cryptid terms, I believe a wolf man is just the same as a dog man. It's completely different from a werewolf, so don't get that mixed up in case you were just kind of wondering. So it is. Sure is pretty, huh? Yeah. Well, when you're free done admiring it, come and get your food. It's getting cold. Okay, cool. Thanks. Do I still have my lamp? God damn it. I can't talk to anybody. Take a bowl. Um, where's the shoe? I've got a bowl. There we go. And what happens if I wander off? Okay, I shouldn't wander too far. Yeah, you're probably right, conscience. Hey, can I sit down? Sit. We'll eat. Okay, you, you, you a barbarian. We've got a spoon and you're drinking it like um, soda. I don't know how to get- oh! It's so nice to see you guys again. Yeah, I'm glad I ended up coming. It's been a while, hasn't it, since we were all together. Yeah, like almost a year now. You were right. The sky looks nice out here. Yeah, it's perfect. Nice to get away from all the light pollution. So, do you guys want to hear the legend of the wolf man? Oh great, this again. 
Hey, I know I can be obsessed with cryptid stuff sometimes, but this one is really creepy. Okay, sure. What is the wolf man? Okay, so it's an urban legend out here about a man that used to own this property. This appeared a long time ago and there's stories that he never actually left. And instead turned into a wolf man that lurks the woods, attacking and eating animals and even humans. That sounds silly. It actually gets more twisted than that. He had a sort of animal sanctuary out here with lots of dogs he would take in and take care of and he lived completely alone aside from the animals. So when he disappeared, no one knew he was gone for a long time. When someone finally came out to check on him, they found something truly terrible inside the house. All the animals had starved to death, locked inside rooms and cages, scratches and blood all over the walls and doors. Oh my god, that's awful! Yeah, that's not even the worst part. They say some of the animals had even started eating each other. And some say it was the owner himself that ate them after he turned into the wolf man. But really, it's just stories told to try and keep kids away from coming out here and underage drinking. Plus, with all the parties that used to happen out here, stories were bound to be made up from the things that people thought they saw or heard. There's even been a few missing persons out here. Yeah, that's why people don't come out here anymore. Cops really started cracking down on the place after that. So why are we out here? For old times sake. Plus all the danger makes it more exciting. You wouldn't want to hang out at any old campground, would you? It's okay, the most dangerous thing out here are deer and bobcats. Oh, and Jack here. Dangerously handsome, maybe. Oh, I'm really liking the way this game does its chapters. I, I am quite liking this. It's been nice catching up, but I think I'm going to head to sleep. Yeah, same. Today's be has been beat. Would you not say I think I'm going to head to bed? You don't say I think I'm going to head to sleep. It's hardly a destination. It's a state of being, my love. You're not going to head to sleep. It's just like saying I'm going to head to being sad tomorrow. Wait, before you guys go, Jack and I have something to tell you. Oh, right. Oh, what is it? Well, I guess I'll just say it. We're getting married! Excuse me, Jack was winking at me earlier. Oh, cool. Yup, finally decided to tie the knot. Wow, I'm so happy for you guys. Thank you. And of course, I'm hoping you'll be my best man, bro. Um, yeah, for sure, man. And I want you two there. I want you there too, Jane. Just like we used to always talk about as kids. Sure, wouldn't miss it. Oh goodness. Give me a bucket, please. You guys go ahead. Jack are going to hang out a little longer, I think. Oh, I know what you two are up to and you and your exorcist neck. What the f You can take the tent. I'll be sleeping in the van. I want the van. Tents can be ripped. Yeah, I'm just coming in here. I'll just sleep in here. Right. Can I not get in?
No, you know what, James? I'm leaving all the doors open. It all for some of them. Yeah. Why am I not in the tent? Oh. Did I just hear a scream? It sounded like it came from that old shack. I should make sure everyone's okay. Let me take a detour this way. Just want to see if anything's happened with me. Cage and shouldn't wander too far. This way, then. Trash pandas away to bed. I'll put. Why was he so protective of this? Anything in here? Walk now because I want stamina. Stamina, I'm not. Hey, hey. And stop it. Oh, stop it. They really have nailed the atmospherics in this game. Hello? Hello? Where the fuck? Jane? What happened here? I don't know, me and Jack were just out here messing around and something attacked us. It all happened so fast I couldn't really tell what was happening. I think Jack is hurt, like, really hurt. But this thing, it was so big and fast, it just picked him up and took him away like it was nothing. I think we have to get out of here. I don't know if we can help him, at least not on our own. Okay, okay. We should get help. Yeah. We need to get to the van. But Jack had the keys. I think he dropped them in here somewhere. We have to find them. Oh god, E and B. Hide. Oh, I forgot that door's not there anymore. Where the hell did they put the keys? Oh, there they are. Oh! Got the keys. Hey, I found the van keys. Let's get out of here. Thank God. Okay, let's go. <gasps> Jack? Jack, is that you? Are you alive? Oh my God! Oh my God! I have to get out of here. Oh my god. James! Oh, hopefully he's got enough to eat from Melissa and Jack. Where's James? Hello? Kiss everybody. I'm a 
got the van. Oh, van keys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where's James? Okay. Let's start the car. Hello? Was that you, James? I just ran over the only one of my friends that I've got left. Ugh. No! Oh, Jane! Oh my god, I've got goosebumps everywhere. What? Oh my goodness, that was absolutely brilliant. Oh, and for a free demo, chapter one. Oh, Johnny's Games, what an absolutely amazing treat this was. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this. <laughs> um, it's certainly, honestly, playing this gave me the chills. Like, my arms are covered in goosebumps, if you could see them right now. Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy this, just did ask for more horrors, I'm trying, going to try and give you some more horrors. I do love horrors. Um, but yeah, please leave a like and a comment if you've seen anything I didn't, or if I missed something and you've done this before, please let me know. But yeah, until the next time, I will see you all in the next one. Wow. 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 Wow.